Hey guys, from Image Anime in New York City, here is my Cube Condor. Kind of a combination of Cube Eagle and Cube Gorilla. Kind of the same deal. The neck kind of goes in like that, with Cube Eagle, and then Gorilla, it's really the same body. Just go in, that's really all there is to it. And now he's Cube Zero. <laughs> really easy, but a lot of fun. What do you guys think about the Jew Odra stuff now? Is it growing on anybody with the blocks? Once again, to transform him, he's just open like that. And you're almost done. He's flip like that. And then finally, you take this piece, and in it goes. There you go. Now, I'm not going to tell you that these are the fanciest things we've ever had, because they're not. But they're really a lot of fun. I really do like the cubes. I do hope that we still get some more fancy stuff in the future. but. These are still a lot of fun. There are more coming. I just placed an order with CS Toys last night. Those are fantastic, yes. We have so many cubes now. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Uh-oh, it's gonna go off screen. <laughs> Zero. I really think this is so much fun. <laughs> All right, then you extend his arms like that. And he still fires the fists, just like Gorilla. All right, can we give him the eagle head? Oh, maybe Tiger goes on the bottom. Yeah, sure that works. That's actually really funny. Yeah. How many of you guys have made fun, stupid things with these? Then you have all these little teeny cubes. Can I give them an arm? Yeah, that works. Uh, who else has an arm? Eagle does. Okay. Oh, I made a new Megazord. Ugh. There we go. I made a thing. Oh. Is it okay? He could definitely go there. Uh, just like the gorilla. I think you put just about anybody up here. Let's put them together properly. For those of you that didn't like the initial Megazord, or Jewel King, what do you guys think of this combination? It's quite a bit more, um, massive. Ugh. It's actually pretty heavy. So he can hold that. He does have arm articulation. He'd have, like, double cannon there, right? Okay, now we can make a mess. You can take the condor and you could put it in one of these places like that and stick the head out. It won't go all the way down. You take your gorilla, it works. So, you can mix and match. It's clearly the exact same mold. There is really no difference minus the very obvious difference, which is the color and the fact that he has a gorilla face in the middle of his chest. That's pretty much it. Then you have your eagle. Despite these not having that really expensive and fancy look to them, they are a lot of fun. They really are, for, I think, adults and kids. This combination is definitely a bit more impressive looking, I think. I mean, this is really, he's got a lot more going on now than he did just the three block stack. Ugh. And for those of you guys that really like those little tiny figures that came with the Morpher, here they are again, but painted. If you buy them individually, these I think all came from Hobby Link Japan. Exact same figure that I already reviewed in the, the Morpher video, but the chest is painted now. Yeah, and the visor, chest and visor. So they've got a little bit more detail. Love the little figures. And then they come with these cute little cubes, which you actually can take apart and then just fold them up. And now, there's a cube. <laughs> these things are fun. So there are those. They've even got the gorilla with the muscles. Really trying to wrap up, but a few more things. Don't go anywhere yet. First, how many of you guys saw episode 10 of Dino Supercharge? Now that would have been a really great episode to come back from the hiatus on. That was a great episode. I really hope for the remainder of Dino Supercharge, it's kind of like that. For those of you guys that saw the episode, what did you think? Speaking of Dino Supercharge, look, an Energem. Give me the Energem. No! Fury? Give it to me now. Oh, it's just DJ. Uh <laughs> I'm from Power Rangers, Traders, Buyers, and Sellers on what? Facebook. I thought you were Fury. You scared me. Why do I have to be just DJ from Power Rangers, Traders, Buyers, well, and Sellers on Facebook it, and that hashtag show on YouTube? It's better than being Fury. Yeah. I have an energy. You do have an energy, right? 
crystal, and then these are metal, the that tips? Is, that is metal, man. You know what I really love about it, though? I what? feel like from different angles, it really gets the properties of the different types of energens they use on the show. Like from here is the, uh, the skinnier version, and then from the sides, you can see like the thicker version, and then from the other sides, you can see like the baby buck version and the different versions they use on the show. That's so, cool. yeah, I think they, uh, they put a lot of thought into this one. Man. The only problem that I foresee with this is if it's crystal, and metal, yeah, it's going to be expensive. Yeah, I knew, I knew you were going to go there, man. <laughs> and, uh, you're right, you're right. So I'm not going to lie. It's uh, you really want to know the price? Well, I'm sure people are going to ask me. Well, well, it's um, uh, <clears throat> it's eighteen dollars. Eighty bucks. No, per no, crystal? no. That's um one eight. It is eighteen dollars, sir. Per crystal? Per crystal. So I want to go ahead and say that's probably one of the cheapest Energems. So if you call now, you'll get this exclusive offer? Well, if you call now, you will get a disconnected tone because they're not ready for sale yet. Oh. Uh, they're probably going to be up in a, in a few weeks. <laughs> in a few weeks for those of you that keep asking for Energems, here's an Energem, not for sale yet, but coming soon. And they're going to do all the colors? They're going to do the primary five first, from what I've been told. And then if that does well, they're going to do gold, gray, purple, silver, and uh, what graphite. Missing? And Did graphite. You say aqua? Gray. Aqua. That was the one I'm missing. Aqua. So these are from Starlight Studios. Of course, they'll post an update and have a direct link. So definitely stay tuned for Energems. 18 bucks per Energem. So make sure you're subscribed. Make sure you're staying tuned, because when these are for sale, I will post an update and if they do the next five I'll post another update these are from Starlight Studios all right I do have more Juodra stuff coming I just wanted to post something that wasn't old news for Juodra but I will be coming back to the older stuff always good stuff coming we're still working on Titano Charge. We've still got vlogs going up. If you've never heard of our vlog channel divided as one always direct links in the video description and with that I must go because I gotta help me out with Titano Charge so Thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't. This is an ongoing Power Rangers toy review channel, so there are always more videos coming. Thank you guys for watching, and good night. I'm back, totally forgot to show the box. That's what happens when you try to do things too fast. Love the box. It's very colorful. I would love a poster of that. And I like this too, but the, the very top of the box is my favorite. And I think this says something like, I think you need a tiger and elephant to go with your cube condor. Something along those lines. Oh, and also, this came from JC, Henshin Vault. It's actually a bandana, but I was using it as a decorative table thing. No, this will not fit in your Japanese or American gun, even though it sort of fits in Japan, but if you force it, it's gonna get stuck, but it does fit into the cubes, kind of. There we go. Okay, good night.